everybody and welcome to Monday. Hola. It is Monday. Hola. It is the start of a new weekly vlog, but this is a bit different because this is a what I did in my week off vlog. So if you didn't yeah. know, well, you'll know by now, I've taken a week off work. Well, actually, it's kind of, yeah, it, it's a week off. It's a full week yeah. off work. Um, I've been from Monday to the Monday. And it's the first time that I've done it for, well, since 2015. It's the first time I've had a proper holiday um, where I've not done anything kind of work related. I know I'm, I'm vlogging, but um, anything kind of royal work related for for about five years, since, since wow. about 2015 when I first started. And although we went to London, I was still kind of working. I was still thinking about the royal, the royal family yeah. and visiting palaces. And although we're not going anywhere in particular, uh, we do have plans for this week. We're going to the Alton Towers Scarefest, which is a big theme park tomorrow. So I'll be vlogging there. Also, we may go to the zoo in the week. I don't know, but I'm just gonna enjoy the time off. I'm gonna read a book. I'm going to uh, wash my car. I'm gonna do some gardening. I'm going to sort through some drawers. Yeah. And it coincides with my week off. It does, well. it it's does. School holiday. Yeah, it's, it's the school holiday. So I'm taking a well-deserved week off. And yeah. we are going for brunch now. We are. The house is being cleaned. Yeah. Bo's dropped off at my parents. Oh. Um, and then we're going to go and do our food shopping as well. So, um, yeah, here's to a good week. Woohoo! Yeah. Yay, going through a little quaint town, a village, place, place. people, names, sounds. <laughs> no, it's the um, world famous Iron Bridge. Oh, look at that side of the road. I've heard dodgy people live over there. You know who you are. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I know you're sort of seen your type before. Right, let's have a look at this beautiful iron bridge. It's recently been, well, a couple of years ago, it was repainted into its original rust colour. Um, although there's some debate in the town of, as to whether that was the actual original colour or not. Apparently they did a sample. Uh, but some people are saying it was actually the undercoat <laughs> and not the main coat. <laughs> Which is quite weird. Oh, we're in traffic. Yeah, What's going traffic on? Lights. Okay, we're on the move again now. I had to pause it while we were at traffic lights. Lots of little quaint restaurants and shops and all the rest of it. <gasps> oh, yeah, that might be... They might be fixing up flood defences. Uh, it does does flood this side of the river. But, yeah, there's the there's the bridge. Uh, very touristy. You see lots of tourists and people. But, yeah, there's the bridge. Can we see it? Good bridge. Whoops. There you go, right over the bridge. Um, but yeah, lots of, lot, very touristy. Um, very quaint. Yeah, very quaint. Typically brought up. <laughs> Cleo's for cocktails. <laughs> go to Cleo's for cocktails. Right, straight on up. I think. Hey everybody. Hi. It is Tuesday. It is Tuesday. I've <laughs> got my days right today. And I've got my... Um, my Sahara scarf on, and I look good. Gone, I'm, am I gone with the wind? You are. I haven't gone with the wind. Not that, not the other sort of wind. Oh, no. I haven't got those winds. No, we are in the car. We are off to uh, Alton Towers Scarefest, Yay. the Halloween spectacular at the theme park. But we're going to have a McDonald's breakfast to start with. Yes. So we're on our way. Let's, let's commence. Hmm. Just stopped to get some petrol. Um, at the Tesco Extra, although I'm not quite sure what's extra about it. There's no fabulousness. It's not extra at all. Literally vlogging at McDonald's. Mm. Hmm.
Uh, we made it, it's raining. It is. <laughs> but we are here. The monorail's shut, so we've got to kind of walk. Yeah. So, yeah, we're going to join the queue and get in there. Yeah. Oh, we made it. Yeah. We are in. <laughs> and we see lots of pumpkins and all kinds of things. Um, wow. So, yeah, we made it. Yeah. And we they, they scanned our temperature. So it's all safe and secure. And I think we're, we're very cold <laughs> and wet. So we're gonna have a coffee, do you think? Yeah. I think, I think so. We've just come off the Smiler ride. There's an Alton Towers castle up there. And it's been soaking, hasn't wet. it? It's really, really wet. So wet. Um, and we were stood in the queue for about an hour. <laughs> but the ride was really, really good. Obviously, I couldn't film. Um, but yeah, it's very, very wet. And we are absolutely soaked, just to kind of look at that. We are soaked. Yeah. So we're going to try and find somewhere to have something to eat, maybe get dry, that kind of thing. So, Check back later. Go out and have fun, they said. In the rain, they <laughs> We're said. We're back in the car. Look, I am absolutely, I'm absolutely soaked, even through my coat. Yeah. Look at this weave. Look at this weave, it's dreadful. Um, but apparently, if it's a rainy day, you can actually get a free entry to another day when they're open. So yeah. that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna call it a day, go home, have a bit of a duvet day, maybe have something to eat. Oh, look at it. So yeah, um, that's what we're going to do. We are. Abort mission. Abort. Okay, so we are comfort eating after our ordeal. Look at the pizza and the chicken and the wedges. Yummy. Hi everybody and welcome to Wednesday. My goodness, what a different looking day today. The weather is beautiful. Ah, we were just so rained off yesterday. We were soaked, we were cold. We basically got home and had a bit of a duvet day once we got home because we were so cold and wet and damp and horrible if only we'd have gone today but never mind basically uh, as i said before we can actually go again for free because it's because it was classed as a rainy day so we'll go again it's fine we did one ride literally one ride and that was it but it was good um and it was good to get out and we had a bit of a scenic route home so that was nice to see some little villages and that kind of thing anyway um today as i said it's wednesday i'm continuing my holiday and i think we're going to bake a cake i think i am finally going to get that meadow planted i'm finally going to do it and there's a few other jobs in the garden that need doing as well we still have roses believe it or not looking a bit bedraggled but we still have roses um the red the red ivy has now is now actually shedding its leaves, so that will be gone now until the spring. We do have some kind of semi-evergreen ivy as well, because believe it or not, that one does actually lose, it does drop its shed, its leaves, um, biennially or, or something of that nature. Anyway, um, a nice day, so a really nice autumnal day to go in the garden. We have a molly over here on the fence and Matt is inside watching daytime breakfast TV because it's too cold for him but I'm okay I like it um my mom actually put these uh, winter pansies in so they're in um and there's and obviously we still have uh, lots of leaves on the roses so yes I, I think it's a meadow planting day today hi everybody and welcome to Sunday we are about to go out for my mom's birthday uh, we're going to go out for a Sunday lunch, so I'll try and get a little bit of footage of what we're eating when we're there. But basically, this vlog is going to be a lot shorter than normal. Um, I've got a few more openings to do after this, but other than that, it will be just a really short vlog. So, um, I will catch back with you later.
And welcome to Tuesday. It's the first time I've picked the camera up this week since my week off. So I'm back. I'm back from my week off. Uh, I really enjoyed it, but it was wet. It was raining. We couldn't really go anywhere. You saw the clips from the theme park and it was just wet. We came home and it pretty much stayed that way for the whole duration of the holidays. Anyway, uh, Matt is back to work now uh, and I'm starting a new weekly vlog. Uh, I actually missed last Monday because there wasn't a lot of footage. There wasn't enough to put together to make a vlog. So um, I kind of, I've rolled it all over into one. So this is the official start of the new weekly vlog. Uh, I'm about to go to Sainsbury's to get a few bits and bobs. Matt and I went out last night. I didn't film, uh, but we went to Nando's because England is going into lockdown for another month, at least another month. It could be longer, could be extended. But oh my goodness, I was so depressed when the news was announced. I really didn't want another lockdown. Matt can still go to work during this lockdown, so it is a bit different. The schools are open, so Matt gets to go out. Um, but I was kind of dreading, because I work from home, literally being locked down, all the shops and everything, non-essential shops are completely shut. Um, leisure, tourism, hospitality, all that kind of thing. So just essential shops are going to be open from Thursday. So it's we're okay at the moment, but the proper lockdown starts on Thursday. I was, I mean, I know, I understand the reason why we need it, but I, I've kind of been dreading it. It kind of, it upset me a bit. Anyway, um, so um, yeah, we're going to have life in lockdown part two. <laughs> I know it's dreadful, but it is essential. We need it. All of the deaths were going up and all the rest of it. So we do need it. So I'm not going to moan. I'm not going to complain. I'm just going to, you know me, I'm just going to quietly get on with it, my loves, like I always do. Hello everybody, Hi. it is Sunday, it is actually Remembrance Sunday and I've literally just, we've just set off in the car and uh, I've just seen the Queen at the Cenotaph and uh, Prince Charles and um, the Duchess of Cambridge is there, Catherine's there, so, but we are on the road, we, are, we actually went yesterday to have a look at um, at another set of new houses. This one's a little bit, my no, oh, this one's another li a little bit more rural. So we're having a bit of a jaunt out and the lady we spoke to yesterday said we could come back today and have a look at an unfinished property because they haven't got a show home ready. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to have a bit of a site tour, have a look at an unfinished home, see if we really do like it or, or not. Um, and hopefully I'll be able to get a little bit of footage of, of the house. Yeah. But remember, it's unfinished. It is not finished. So we'll see what state it's in. But yeah, that's what we're going to be doing. Um, and yeah, that's, that's our day for today. Hello and welcome to the openings part of the vlog. I've got a few things to open. In fact, actually this one I accidentally opened uh, a few days ago. So let's just show you exactly what it is. Somebody has sent me a brand new tiara and I didn't look who, I, I, I looked and then kind of put it back. I'm not quite sure who it was. So if it was you, then please do let me know. But look, I have got a, a new Russian fringe tiara. I do actually already have one very similar, but I think this one looks um, slightly better 
better version, I think. Uh, like I said, I haven't opened it, I just kind of peeked in there. Got very excited and then closed it all back up again. So let's see if we can get it out. Oh yes, I think this one is different because I think it's got longer arms. I don't think mine has got the, the longer arms on it. So get a load of that. I think that looks amazing. Should we try it? And of course, Princess Beatrice wore this one. Yes, this is different. Uh, Princess Beatrice wore this one uh, for her wedding, on her wedding day. <gasps> oh, look, that's amazing. I'd wear it like that. <gasps> yes, it's fabulous. I love it. Um, so that will be, I can add some, some um, what I normally do is I normally tie a little bit of elastic to the back so it kind of just holds on. Um, but yeah, no, that is definitely I think um, a lot better than the one that I've got. So thank you, whoever it was. Thank you so, so much. I, of course, uh, will send you my best wishes and thanks. Okay, okay, so next we have this. Now this, uh, I'm not quite sure who it's from. There's nothing on the front, I think, to say who it's from. Uh, but let's get into it anyway. I am very intrigued. I think probably this end might be the best end to start with, so let's go into it. Ooh, ooh, it looks like books or magazine or something. Let's just get all the stuff out first, make sure I'm looking just inside. Um, ooh, now this is, oh, Victorian Trading Company. It's a, it's a catalog, uh, an autumn 2020 seasonal antique replicas, seasonal gifts, fine art prints, clothing and jewelry, romantic home. Um, Thank you, whoever it is. Oh, I know who it is. It's got the address on the back, so I'm not gonna show you. Uh, it's Carolyn. Thank you, Carolyn. So I'm gonna keep Carolyn's uh, address private because it's on the back. But thank you, Carolyn. It looks like some um, really interesting things. Let's just take a little perusal, shall we? Uh, some candles. Some... Do you know what? There's some really nice, I'll, I'll just show you a page. Oh, look at that chair. Look at that chair there. That is incredible. There's some really nice things in here. I could probably make, oh look, I look at that seat. Wow, I could probably make a vlog just looking at some of these things. Oh, there's Halloween things, slightly a bit too late for Halloween, but wow. Oh, there's some good things. Thanks, you know what? I need to have a perusal of this with a cup of coffee, so thank you, Carolyn. Okay, and there's a letter inside. So let's, it's probably, probably a letter that, again, I probably need to sit down and have a really good read of. Uh, properly to do it justice. So thank you so much. Um, it's a note. Uh, oh, thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so, so much, Carolyn. Much to you. Okay, we have a letter um, and it says personal on the envelope. So I think that means, please don't read out to anyone else, but I will just at least show you that I've got the letter. So uh, if you send if you send this envelope, then uh, I've got it all well and safe. Um, oh, thank you so much. I will, again, I, it's, a, it's a nice big letter, so I will read that um, when I've got a moment with a cup of coffee, so thank you. Okay, so I think that basically concludes this week's vlog. I know it's been another short one. Nothing much has happened. The UK's gone back into lockdown. Shops and you know non-essential places are not open anymore. Um, and most of the things around the house I've shown you, I've shown you baking, I've shown you things. Uh, so I promise to do a bit more of a garden update. By the way, I still, I still haven't got the meadow planted. I'm so bad, I know, smack my wrist. Uh, but yeah, I've still got to do that. There's still a few gardening things I need to do. I still need to do a few things to, to wind down the garden for winter, um, even though it's kind of getting in, getting into November. A bit of an update before I go on the house that we went to look at. So I couldn't really show you any footage inside because the lady was, was with us. Um, so I didn't really feel like getting the camera out, out too much. Um, so I just got a little quick shot of not actually the bit that we're looking at. We're looking at a, a kind of a different bit of the development. So, but anyway, you got a, an, an idea of kind of where we were, um, what we were doing. It was a really nice kind of experience. Let, oh, let me just tell you all about that. I may as well while we're here. So um, there, there wasn't a show home available. They were at the very, very early stages of development. 
So they showed us into, well, she showed us into a house type, well, several house types, and then we kind of settled on the one that we thought we were interested in. We saw it basically when it's still like timbers. I mean, you could, you could go in it, we went in it. You're at the stage where you're literally just about to put the plaster boards on the wall. So you kind of needed to have a bit of imagination. So we kind of saw that. Then we went into another one that was a little bit further on in progress and we do really really like them it's a bit more rural so there's kind of lots of lots of countryside around the whole development so it has a really nice kind of country feel about it so um i went back today with my parents to kind of show them while matt was at work and although we didn't get to go in the houses because they were all fully booked you have to book now to to have an appointment we did get to kind of walk outside and have a little look. So uh, that's kind of where we're at with that. It's obviously a different development to the one where we went into the show home before. So we are kind of having a little look around to kind of see what's going on uh, with the market at the moment. Anyway, uh, so I'm gonna leave you all for this week. Again, I know another quick, short vlog, but hey, that's the way the cookie crumbles some weeks, especially during life in lockdown. I do hope it ends soon. I really do. It's supposed to be for another three weeks. Pretty much i hope it's not extended and i hope it finishes soon for, for my own sanity let's put it that way so anyway if you've enjoyed this week's vlog as short as it is please give it a big old thumbs up don't forget to share on social media and also do hit the bell so that you know whenever we upload a new video so from us in shropshire matt's playing video games unwinding after work um to you all and you.